All right, guys, you see what it is. It's about that time booking that one way ticket. Of course, I'm not going to disclose my uh, departure date. Um, but yes, it's, it's about that time. I've been over planning and I, you know what? You just have to just take the leap of faith and just do it. And that's what I'm going to do. I've done the work. I've done the saving my money. I've done creating three multiple streams of online income. So I know I'm set on that. Uh, it's just too much crazy stuff that's going on in here in the U.S. A lot of shootings here in Houston. Uh, children getting shot by stray bullets on the highways. And uh, I'm just about, I'm just fed up with it. So I'm coming to Niger, baby. Mama Africa, here I come. Hey guys, come along with me to the storage real quick. I got to drop off some things and also reorganize my uh, cast iron pot collection that I've been building up for over a year now whenever I see a cast iron piece that I like I buy it uh, because I am I've been creating some things in my mind once I get to Nigeria that I want to have in a beautiful outdoor kitchen and uh, that's one of the things that I, I had enjoyed when I had took a trip to uh, in in Nagu, in Nagu. <laughs> in Agu, Nigeria, the ladies were out there uh, cooking in the outdoors kitchen and I really wanted to uh, implement that once I move into my grandmother's home. Um, I'm, I'm going to create a nice outdoor space and outdoor kitchen where I can um, do a little cooking and learn all of the native dishes while I'm there in Nigeria. So I'm, I'm really excited for that. And uh, right now I'm about to go into my storage units. Uh, these are all the items that I'm going to be shipping out uh, to the storage right now. So it's all packed up. If you can remember when I was in my apartment, how everything was packed up. So this is my storage unit. Not too big, but enough for me to you know get things shipped. Now this is my babies right here. This is my cast iron collection. I've been getting like one or two pieces here and there. Whenever I see something new, I just grab it because I want something that is going to be durable and I can pass on uh, to a family member or to uh, some kids uh, that I may uh, adopt in the future. Who knows how the future may hold. But yeah, um, I've been buying a piece here and there at a, a discounted price at like TJ Maxx, Marshalls or Ross. And whenever I see it, I grab it um, because they can be pretty pricey, believe it or not. But I'm excited about that I built, look at my uh, my cast iron tea kettle. Now I've been having that for years, um, but I'm taking that with me. That's what well, I'm gonna be baking a whole lot of dishes up in there. Look at that grill back there. <laughs> Man, you got the grill press where I can have some fresh fish on the grill. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes, these are my babies. I kind of wanted to show y'all um, because I want to have some, a beautiful set of cast iron pots. Like I said, when you're doing outdoor cooking on a fire, uh, this is something that you want to kind of have that can uh, withstand those type of fires. Like I said, stated uh, before, when I was in Inugu, uh, the ladies were cooking in the outdoor kitchen. And I'm gonna show a clip of that right now. This is when they were, look at that. They had the fire and everything. This is like the native way of how they have always, co always cooked in the past, you know, before the stoves and stuff came about. And uh, I actually want to incorporate that. Here's another image of uh, an outdoor cooking setting uh, right here. This is like in Morocco right there. And uh, I want to moderate, modernize it a little bit. And this is something that I want to kind of get an idea of a design. And this one, oh, I love this design right here. This is kind of like perfect uh, of what I'm looking for. Or even then incorporating some woods and stuff like that. But yeah, that's just some... Um, little little things that I've been working on in my little uh, creative uh, book but yeah I'm going to end this video just wanted to kind of show y'all what I've been doing and I guess I'll check you guys later it's not how you start it's how you finish